We're heading to the Renaissance Hotel to meet up with the girls and the rest of the family and Cody and Matt is here. I'm hoping that's getting you. I'm on super wide, so I'm hoping it's getting all of us. This is Ian. And this is Ian. He's got a YouTube channel. What is it? MMP Pro. You should go follow. I am on the closed Call of Duty and other gaming videos. He's also a real badass at Connect 4, so you're probably going to want to watch him play that for hours and hours and hours. So uh, we're in a cab, as you can see, and we are, uh, and this is very nice right here, I must say, it's soft to the touch. If they could make every car interior this fabric, I think we'd be a better planet, and people probably wouldn't fight. We are um, hanging out, and we're trying to get there to meet everybody else. Apparently for, I always say apparently, but for some money, you can actually use the resort. So that we're hoping that uh, it's not too crowded. Cody just got there and said the parking is tough. You know, I don't know what that means, but uh, when we get there, I will lay down the law and let you guys see exactly what we're seeing and how much it costs to spend a day there. Apparently towels are included. Is lunch included? Uh, no. No, lunch is not included, but our journey continues. We're following this motorcycle. I don't know if you can see him. Probably not. No. Okay. Update to come. So basically here you pay what I think is amounts to $20 and you're able to rent beach chairs. You have to give a 100 yen deposit for each towel that you're gonna borrow from the hotel, but it's really nice and they have a really nice beach area here. And then when you go in the water, it's actually pretty shallow. Matt is right over there and he is having a great time enjoying it. There's And then you can also do other things here. So let me just pan over here so you can see. Over there, there's like an orange boat and in that little lagoon, which is on the other side of the bridge, is a place where you can actually swim with dolphins. They have dolphins there. I thought that was pretty amazing. Uh, you can also go on one of those giant, like, floaty hot dog rides, I guess you want to call it. And you can also rent jet skis and kayaks like you see uh, out there as well. And this is just this area. They also have a pretty big trampoline, which is really nice. The kids can jump up and down on. And then they have a uh, swimming pool here, which is a really huge pool. And I'll get it, I'll show it from the uh, top so you can see the whole thing. But they also have an area that's maybe about, for me it's maybe just a little over knee high, where uh, little kids can go down a slide. And the hotel will actually provide like the floaty things for you. So you can actually put it on your child's arms. And you can actually wait for your kid to come down the watery slide. There's a little pad that floats on the water so the kid doesn't go right into the water after the slide. And it's actually very nice. My son is five and he is just having a blast with his friends who we also invited out today. If you want to like stay on a resort and have like beach chairs like here, you know, and have some of the amenities that resorts have for 20 bucks, I think it's fantastic. It's a fantastic view. So here we are going up just off the uh, the pool. You come up these stairs. There's the pool down there, which I will get a better shot of. You come up here, and there's the pool area, and you can go all here. Your kids. It's not like I said. It's not deep. See, it's not deep at all. And your kids can have fun. Young kids can have fun. Hope you can hear me over the road noise because uh, the road is actually right over here. But there's uh, an attendant up here at all times. So you don't have to worry about it. For me, this is the coolest part of the Renaissance Hotel. And as you can see, there's the Renaissance Hotel up there. But down there, that's awesome. That's the little kitty slide, the water slide, and the kid goes down it. And there's like a pad right there. There's my little guy. I don't know what he's doing, but look at the pool. It's pretty awesome. And just behind the pool, you have the, the food area where you can order hot dogs. Uh, you can order hamburgers, cheeseburgers. There's beer. There's sodas. There's juices. There's ice cream. There's all kinds of things. Now. The dolphins are just by that building over there, and we're gonna to try to go over the bridge and see if we see them at all. They weren't uh, out a few minutes ago, but I'll try again. For 20 bucks, you get to use all the amenities, all the chairs, uh, all, you can get the towels, you can use, you can go to the kiddie pool, the big pool, you can also go to the beach and get a, you know, an umbrella. Everything is included in that cost, and it's actually very, very nice. 
burger. <laughs> mm. <laughs> like the fries? Yeah. Good stuff. You like being here? Yeah. Do you think it's worth the money? No. No? He doesn't think it's worth the money. It's bizarre. <laughs> what would you value this resort at? 20 bucks a day or 30 bucks a day? 30 bucks a day. 30 bucks a day. Yeah. So then we're. Good thing he got in for free. Yeah, good for him. So rumor has it there's a sea lion and what else? A kangaroo? Yeah. And a kangaroo, random, at Not the true. Renaissance today. So let's go see this. Sea lion and kangaroo. Maybe it's true, maybe it's not. We're gonna go see. Apparently they do have a sea lion and other sea creatures here. Wow. He was out here. Wow, look at him. Do what she says, man. <laughs> so we got like a seal cage here. Oh, here it comes. Here it comes. Uh, uh, uh. What'd you say? You watch Madagascar 3, now you know all about sea lions? No, I don't know if it's a seal or a sea lion. Madagascar 3 didn't have the answers? We no, I didn't. We don't know. We don't know. <laughs> we don't know. Right. You can rent a suite by the pool. Here's the pool. There's the suite. Don't know how much they cost, but they look pretty awesome. And you're also next to the seal. So they even have manta rays. I'm gonna try to see if I can get them to be seen. They seem to be following one. I'll try it from here. Am I even making sense? I'm so excited about the manta rays. I, am I even making sense? Here we go. Matt, look at that. Look at that. What? Hey, there you go. There's the dolphins. You just saw them. And apparently you can swim with the dolphins, which I did not know. So you got manta, manta rays here, dolphins there. Did you have fun? Yeah? That's pretty big. This is the, this is the indoor pool, indoor pool. Go down the slide. It's pretty amazing. Did you have fun today? Yeah. Who did you play with? Um, I just like the joke that we did. Yeah. Played with Tai Tai. So nice. So bad, looking good. Less than 24 hours, dude. You'll be, you'll be back on a plane to Connecticut. Not looking forward to it. Uh, Not Japan, man. So much fun. <laughs> so much fun. Yeah. Spend more time in the ocean than on land. Yeah, that's no, good though. That's, you know, I can't get this ocean where I'm from. That's for sure. So I'd like to just thank everybody for watching today this video. Of course, it was done actually maybe a little longer than a year ago. Uh, the Renaissance is still a pretty cool place to go and have an afternoon. Once all this mess with this virus is gone, I'm sure you and your family will love enjoying it. Remember, if you know anybody in the military, active duty, or spouse, I guess we can't give them a hug or handshake in these times, but just acknowledge everything they do because it is not easy. And I'd like to take this time to thank all the first responders, police officers, medical professionals for everything they're doing to help flatten the curve. Thanks, everybody, and I'll see you next video.